Community members from all walks of life gathered here at the Bogus Ford Event Center in FAR to hear more about an issue that affects everyone in the Rio Grande Valley, immigration. Should the local government hold illegal immigrants on ICE detainers at the risk of losing state funding? Tuesday night, a panel of experts on different sides of the immigration issue explored solutions to one of the nation's most complicated topics. No one should be detaining immigrants and making a profit out, out of it. That the White House has, in, in, men, in large regard, uh, in, uh, used executive action to provide uh, short-term solutions to immigration that are not sustainable, that are not long-term. Questions were asked by Valley residents who attended the event and from social media users. Panelists touched on the delicate balance between showing compassion toward immigrants and upholding the law. There are laws on the books. A lot of us believe that if we just had, if we just, if the government would just enforce the laws we had, a lot of this confusion would be eliminated. The economic factors, as important as they are, must not uh, cast a shadow on the human side of things. One man says he attended the CBS 4 News Town Hall in order to learn information that can help his family and friends in Mexico. They want to come over here because there's a lot of problems over there in Mexico. Others say they just wanted to do their part to become more educated on the immigration crisis. We surely do have a broken immigration system and I'm glad to see people from perhaps uh, different opinions come together and have a serious discussion about uh, solutions. And if you were not able to make it to this forum tonight, we will have the entire event available online. In FAR, Annalise Ortiz, CBS4 News and ValleyCentral.com.